Hello everybody. This is my regrinding station. It's in the kitchen, of course. Um, what I did was I bought this uh, blender. It's a six-speed blender. Uh, I think it's 450 watt blender. And what I did was I took uh, some of these. These are some kind of pipe pliers, uh, channel locks, I guess. And I kind of grabbed each little plastic piece and twisted them off. Uh, kind of got them down and sometimes I chop them up uh, if it was thin enough I would use my scissors to cut them up uh, but anyway I got got it down to pieces about the size of one to two centimeters uh, I think one to two sugar cube size and uh, then I shoved them in here and then uh, just uh, I pulsed it a few times until I got it to some kind of uh, you know small grinds and then just ground it and ground it and ground it until I got to uh, you know, not quite powder form, but you can see it's all flakes. So there we go, uh, kind of flakes. And so here's an example of what I extruded with the uh, blue flakes. And this is turned out really good, uh, real good solid. It comes out shiny, it looks, looks like. Of course, I use these little uh, earbuds to cover my ears when I run the blender because it's really loud. Uh, but anyway, that seems to work really well. I found these little Talenti... Uh, jars that my wife saved for me and they work really good for storing uh, all that and it's amazing how little amount of uh, of this regrind stuff it takes to make uh, filament so I was really impressed uh, you can see those little white beads in there are some uh, virgin grind that I had came out of there uh, just so I just tuck it in there because it'll it'll blend it'll won't change the color too much but anyway uh, you can see I've got some black I've got some blue I've got some gray now and now I have some red, and I will run that through my Philostruder and see if I can make some more filament. Anyway, I thought y'all would enjoy that. Uh, oh, there again, the reason why I have tape all over this blender is because I tried shoving uh, a whole piece of uh, plastic down in there, something that I had printed. And when I ran it, uh, the first little blob of uh, filament uh, you know, regrind came out okay. The second one, it blew out the side. <laughs> so I don't know if you can see it's all broken and cracked and stuff now. Uh, so what I ended up doing was just uh, covering it with uh, clear tape, uh, clear sticky tape, and then uh, two inch tape, and then uh, just instead try to make the pieces, uh, you know, just about gay size, no bigger than that. Uh, and that seems to grind without, you know, throwing it through the walls. Uh, so anyway, uh, that's my experience. I hope y'all uh, enjoyed that. Maybe it'll help you. Uh, talk to you later. Bye.